It has been almost two weeks since Ida rained down on Manville, New Jersey, turning the borough into a disaster area. But debris remains spread out all over the place. CBS 2's Meg Baker has more on what's causing the cleanup delay. Mattresses, couches, the insides of gutted houses, and bags and bags of belongings still line the streets of Manville. The cleanup was delayed for two days after the dump filled up. The front of my house smells like a cow barn. Rolls of carpet sit outside Michael Side's home. We lost our whole basement, so we cut the padding and the rugs into small strips, and then we bagged them. We have approximately 25 black bags on the front lawn. Now residents are being told that sealed black bags will not be picked up with other debris unless residents go back into their piles of smelly bags and open up the knots to show what is inside. They want us to go through it all and it's like who wants to relive this over again. Here on North 6th Avenue you can water line on this holly tree it reaches above my head going into people's basements and their first floors. Kimberly Haina lives here and was rescued on a kayak. She lost everything. She used black bags to carry the wet and muddy items outside. They donated the bags to us and now they want us to go through the garbage and get it all out and it's just too much. Matt Loper with Somerset County explains that after Bridgewater's dump reached capacity, the county had to set up a temporary debris management area in Hillsborough. We're taking all of our material to there on a temporary basis and then it will go out to landfills and transfer stations after that. But because there could be food waste in these bags, we're not allowed to store that in a temporary area like we're doing. So we're focused on picking up all the other materials first on a first round, and then we're gonna come back at a later date and, uh, and pick up everything that's remaining. He says it's a public health issue. You can either open up the black bags on your property or keep them sealed and wait it out. The county expects to finish up cleanup in the next week and a half. In Manville, New Jersey, Meg Baker, CBS 2 News. It's quite a job. Oh, man. That's gonna do it for us here today at five. Thanks for watching. I'm Christine Johnson. I'm Maurice Dubois. The news at six starts right now.